Welcome, Welcome back, back to the Cruise Brothers React, React back, back for more Demon, Demon Slayer. Slayer. And we're here at the Mugen Train arc as always. Again, if you want to see our blind reaction and first time reaction to the Mugen Train arc, you can get it on our Patreon under the Four Star Pledge. We react to movies on the Four Star Pledge exclusively. Uh, they are not coming to YouTube. I know a lot of people ask that. Um, so if you want to support the channel and get our first time reaction to the Mugen Train arc on our Patreon, consider supporting. It helps us put out these videos every single day. He said, he, he said, no matter how strong you are, I can still destroy you from the inside. All he has to do is break them down, Johnny. He's saying humans are weak because of their emotions. This guy's an asshole. <laughs> Actually, not, I'll take that back. He's pretty. Come on, man. What the fuck you talking about? He's ass. Yeah, he's not up to par though. Motherfucker, you think you think they would have took him out if it wasn't for fucking Rengoku? Alright man, relax. Shut your ass up, man. Everybody seen this shit. <laughs> Lower one. Come on, he's getting, he was the only one spared. Here we go with this guy. You already know it. This is a dr his dream. Or Zanetsu's dream. Oh, in his dream form, he could use his power whenever he wants, Johnny, and control yeah. it perfect. He wishes he could do that shit in real life. Seriously. And he wishes Nezuko was his girl. <laughs> what the fuck? He's drowning. Is this what it means to be in the void? <laughs> you know, it's very interesting that both of them are dreaming of our main character's fucking sister. <laughs> hey, man. Pompoko. Why you, why you make him look like that, bro? <laughs> Chewy too. What is he, a rat? That's a fucking cartoon, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? This man is dreaming of taking on a fucking train boss in a cave. <laughs> this is Black where we find characters. out more about Rengoku's past. Yeah, I ain't know about his past, huh? Yeah, maybe, yeah. <laughs> um, Rengoku's story is like actually the main appeal of this arc for me, bro. Well, I mean, it is the Rengoku show. Damn, look at him so happy to tell his dad that he finally became a Hashira. And this motherfucker ain't even looking at him. Damn. That's what depression looks like, Chris. That's crazy, bro. That motherfucker. This man, depressed. he did all he could to become a Hashira to prove, to prove something to his dad, bro. And he doesn't care. He still thinks he's a piece of shit. <laughs> he used to be a demon slayer and Hashira too, man. Passionate to him, bro. I don't think we know why he is the way he is. We never showed that. So uh, yeah, maybe, we might maybe find not. out maybe. in the new episodes. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. You gotta look after your brother, man. Oh, that's why his dad is like that, because I think his mom passing away. Oh, yeah. It's gotta be the role model, bro. I go such a good guy. His dad just gave up, man. Yeah, man, and he understands that his, his fucking little brother is gonna go through it more than he did. So that's why he's trying to be his inspiration. That's crazy, bro. He said, you're not like me, man. You have a big brother that believes in you. I have nobody that believes in me. <laughs> that's fucked up. <laughs> yeah, but he has the memories of his uh, mother, at least. Come on, man. Bro, the, come on, man. When their mother was alive, it was probably different. That's why he's gotta make him feel better. Oh, shit, he's gonna get in there, Johnny. They're having a good dream right now, but once he goes in... Damn, he compared you to a baby. Fucking baby. Not a baby. He said, you're no match for me in the dream world. I wonder if they showed anything about his brother. I forget what happened to his brother. Damn, so all they gotta do is break on the... They, it kills them? Apparently? Or did some shit? Spiritual core. This has to be like some general information type shit. Like this isn't exclusive to this guy's power. Spiritual core is a real thing. Damn. And that's his core, bro. Look at the flames. The power. She the destruction. Fucking, she can't handle this, man. That shit is cool as hell. Realistic ass flames. <laughs> Don't want to fuck with that core. That shit look hella dense. <laughs> Bro, she fucking with the wrong one. I'd be scared to touch that thing. Oh. God. 
god! See? This man just freaking subconsciously fucking protected his spiritual core. That's how strong he is, bro. Damn. Her head about to pop, bro. Even asleep, bro. See, man. Ron Goku could do that, but if one of these guys gets their shit attacked, they're done. This eerie ass music. For real. Should sound like a Christmas carol. Look at this kid, bro. Pathetic. Sorry. All he wants to do is go into his dream world, bro, and live a happy life. <laughs> Aren't they doing this so they can die? <laughs> they're pretty much doing this so they can live in the dream world, I think, because their their life sucks. Nezuko, what the hell are you talking about, man? You ain't got Nezuko on you. Yeah, it's coming back to you, huh, dumbass? Come on, Tanjiro, snap out of it already. <laughs> you see the science, man. This is too good to be true. <laughs> this man is tweaking. What do you mean it's gone? You didn't even see it. <laughs> Motherfucker sensed it. Saw it with his peripherals, bro. Damn, man. Water and fire be looking no joke in this shit. Oh, shit! Wake your dumb ass up! That's the real Tanjiro. Fight, oh, damn it! man. Snap out of it. He just spawns here, bro. Like, he's like, what the fuck happened? <laughs> yeah, seriously. I think we talked about this in the movie, too. Like, imagine waking up in the dream and you can't get out. I'll be like, yo, what the fuck? Like, imagine finding out you're in a dream. You know, just remembering what he did to wake himself up. It's just gonna be crazy. What did he do? <laughs> Come on, man. Like you said, I won't see the movie, right? That wasn't like more than 10 minutes ago that you said that. I wonder why Nezuko didn't get uh, affected by the spells. Is it because she's a demon? And she's not human? Maybe. Damn. Fuck. She used her demon energy, bro. She lit him on fire. <laughs> She lit a spark in his ass. The real Tanjiro is back. The Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer Tanjiro, man. Did we ever get an explanation what that scar on his forehead is? No. What the fuck is that? It ain't gonna be that easy to get out of here. Oh, Even from no. what we know right now. Uh oh. Hey, Dick Nezuko was in his dream. This was their last weapon against them. <laughs> the last resort. Come on. They're really trying to pull them back into the dream, bro. <laughs> They're like, come on, just come back home, man. <laughs> Take those clothes off. That's not you. <laughs> like, think about it, man. I'm pretty sure a lot of people have shitty enough lives to want to just stay in a dream forever. I mean, what, if I subconsciously knew that this was fake, <laughs> I would feel weird about that shit. Hey, man. Who's to say you're not sub you're fake right now? Motherfucker, you a simulation? <laughs> yeah, you, you ain't a simulation, real? bro. You ain't real. So when I when I look away, you ain't there. No. <laughs> and when this backhand comes to your face, it's gonna. It's <laughs> like it's stupid, bro. No. Damn, that's fucked up. Not the little boy, the brother. <laughs> Damn, Damn, that's fucking sad. That should be the fucking runaway cry, bro. It's fucked up, man. Just thinking about they are all actually dead, bro. Damn, that makes it even worse, bro. <laughs> Like, even, yeah, not only if you had a shitty life, just imagine, like, your whole family's dead and, like, all you want to do is be with your family. I'd rather be in a dream world, too. Oh, shit. This man has been stalling. Yeah, I don't understand why they all didn't just go straight for the spiritual core in the beginning. Because you find the spiritual core based on where the guy, the person is. And look at Tanjiro's heart, so peaceful, John. This is the heart of a, of a shonen protagonist. <laughs> Y'all remember this. His dad, Johnny. Oh, shit. His dad's ghost is that powerful that he was able to go into a dream and <laughs> fucking talk to him. Does he remember his dad's voice? Cut it formed from his dream. I remember oh, when I first saw this, shit. I was like, okay, so he has to cut the edge of his thing. That's how he gets out, right? I didn't expect what was going to happen to be this. The edge of this fucking thing to get out, bro. That's what I thought he meant he had to cut. But this man's talking about something else, Johnny. He's about to kill himself. Bro, imagine you feel like you're you're cutting your head off. <laughs> That's just crazy. That little ass fucking slice. That shit didn't sound like he cut off his head. Motherfucker, when sounded you cut your neck, you think you're gonna survive, huh? That motherfucker sounded like he got a paper cut. Paper cut <laughs> <It's> my ass. <laughs> Alright. But uh I mean it's what we expected. It's exactly the movie. Yeah, um, pretty much. Yeah, um, I don't know, man. Uh 
What do you guys think about how they're they're doing this here? Yeah, for the most part, what I want, what I can grab and get from this whole experience of watching this over is a better understanding of everything that went down in the movie. Um, just watching this over, obviously, if you watch anything for a second time, you're gonna get a better understanding of it. But not only that, the I show mean, is huh. kind of like I don't know. I guess it's like, eh. I, I mean, I got everything from the movie. It's very simple. It's not something you need to watch over to really get and grasp fully. It's well, not one of those shows, really. Demon Slayer isn't one of those shows, I don't think. Nah, I think everything for the most part is, is gonna make sense. Cause obviously, we know everything that happens in the movie and it all connected very well. And obviously it's all gonna connect very well in the end. It's just, you know, seeing it again, it, it definitely shows the, I guess the hidden nuances that you might have missed in the first view over. As in like, you know, the stuff with his dad, his dad showing up there. Yeah, I um, guess. There's some cool stuff in there. You know, and, and the other thing with um, the Rengoku's dad, dad as well, that the, stuff is interesting too. The, the dad showing up for... Oh, shit. <laughs> what the fuck is this? This is some anime canon shit right here. <laughs> the fuck? Yo, they didn't show this in the movie, Johnny. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. I ran <laughs> he left him a message, honey. Oh, damn, man, he fucking told us the next episode. That motherfucker yeah. serious. Yeah, because there's something about next episode. <laughs> they gave us a teaser right there. <clears throat> but, um, <laughs> yeah. Again, I, I don't know, man. I'll never be a fan of them redoing shit. I guess for people who haven't seen the movie, and if you haven't seen the movie and you're a fan of Demon Slayer, then I don't think you're a fan of Demon Slayer. Yeah. <laughs> Um, you know, I think the whole dream world thing is cool. Um, it's something similar to a uh, show that we're, we've seen before within Black Clover, you know, like, so it's kind of, um, I don't know. I just, I feel like I've seen this power in a, a lot of different animes before, yeah. like the, the whole dream world power. Speaking but, of uh, Black Clover, man, I just realized like the, I, I, I remember I had some issue with Demon Slayer when I was watching it and I didn't know what it was. But I think it was really like Zenetsu and in those cases like tropes. They have the same shit, bro. That a lot of modern animes have with characters. So that's the one thing that I hope uh, they change. But I'm not holding my breath for that. Yeah. Um, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Tanjiro, I think, is a little better actually. Yeah. But um, but the, the the whole concept of the the way this uh, devil demon's uh dream power works is very interesting because we're learning little by little how his power is working as the episodes go on. If you're seeing this for a first time viewer, um, you know as as things go on, you start to learn more about his power and how it actually works. Um, because right now you see that he's using people to get what he wants done in in the dream world, and right now he's doing something outside of the dream world. So. It, it all comes together in the end in his power and it's just cool to see how uh tanjiro and all of them pretty much just try to maneuver through this this situation that they're in because they they explain this power in depth in this episode as well with the you know the dream world the the core, the, 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 the spiritual core yeah. and then the in between right there you know and right now tanjiro that's why when i first saw this like um when tanjiro was about to cut i thought he was going to cut out of the realm but he ends up killing himself to get out bro yeah. so it's crazy and if i remember right uh getting to the edge of someone's dream uh is based on where they're positioned you got to get farther away from them type shit and that's how you get to the edge of their dream uh, i guess yeah that makes sense so yeah. yeah that's a cool understanding too of their power but yeah mm -hmm. pretty cool we'll see what happens on the next episode guys um yeah, for the most part it's probably going to be what we've seen already but if you guys are seeing this for the first time with us come enjoy the ride with us and we'll see what happens when we get into the and also stuff, guys watch our first time reaction to this as well on yeah. patreon like for right, i know pledge. for a fact we're going to get into some good animation fights here in the anime but if you guys want to see our real first blind reaction to the actual yeah. fight in the animation go see our movie reaction uh, that's definitely where you know definitely more emotion for our first time reaction than uh us watching it right now of course so um yeah, yeah. Uh, like go I check said, that it's out. It's always cool to go back to it. To watch it go check that out, and uh, it'll help support the channel, help us put out these videos as always, as you guys know. And uh, yeah, man, uh, appreciate you for watching. We'll see you guys in the next Demon Slayer reaction. Hope we see, hope to see you there. And uh, yeah, take care of yourselves as always, and peace. peace.